Now fourth uh, example, and this fourth example is all about uh, a car being bought and sold at a profit. So this is a percentage profit. Now let's see how we approach this. It also involves some commission. Now let's see. A car bought for 8,000 shillings was sold through a dealer at a profit of 15%, right? So this is a profit. Now remember 8,000 8, is equivalent to 100%. So now if uh, the profit is 15%, now the selling price will be 115. Okay, you take 100, the original plus 15. So that becomes 115. The dealer charged the owner 8% commission, all right, on the selling price. How much did the owner get? Now, let's approach this. Now, this is what you do. <coughs> Usually say um, uh, that 80,000 is our original price. So it's 80,000 <coughs> is equivalent to 100 so now if the car is sold at a profit of 15 percent now the selling price then should be 115 percent 115 percent right so we're gonna see if 8,000 is 100 percent 115 percent which is our selling price what shall it be so this one becomes this one over this one so this is 115 over 100 times 8,000 times 8,000 and this one comes to 115 sorry 115 times 800 and this gives us times 92,000 right now this is the selling price at a profit of actually the profit is 12,000 right it's 12,000 now in this selling price the dealer gets a commission of 8 per percent right and he gets something because he has done what he's the one who has sold the car so out of this 8 percent goes to the dealer and now the remainder goes to the the owner of the car that is that's how you do it. So we can say here, uh, amount uh, given to the dealer, his commission will be 8%, 8 of 100 times the total amount which the car was sold, 92,000. So we shall have our, the dealer gets 8 by 90. The dealer gets shillings 7,360. 7, so the question was, if out of the 92,000, 7,360 goes to the person who sold, who helped sell the car, who is the dealer. So what is the, the, the owner, the owner of the car, of the car, gets how much? So you get, you get the 92,000, that was the selling price. Then you subtract the amount which has been given to the dealer who has organized and finalized the sale. So this would be 92,000 subtract 360. And the owner of the car finally gets 84,640. 84,640. So it's good to understand and uh, to follow and also to apply these things so that we may be able to solve this problem, uh, questions with no problem. So critical point here is you get a profit of 15%, that means 115%, that is a profit. Now this is, was 8%, that portion of the total amount was going to someone, the dealer, now the remainder should go to the owner so the owner gets this amount so thank you for taking your time and noticing us